I'm more like my dad than anyone in my family. So I think we get each other in this sense that I think we're both intense with things that we do. So I get a lot of my demeanor and like personality from him. So I think we just get each other. He expects more from you because he treats you kind of like he would treat one of his Marines, but as like a daughter. So he's more emotionally attached to like how well you do. A daughter, you want them to be, you know, strong-willed and strong-minded and be able to be independent, to be able to, to operate on your own and to make sound decisions on your own. It upset me and he coached me for a while and then I told him he couldn't come watch me play anymore. He wasn't allowed on court or near my tennis court or like my matches for a very long time. When I was little, my dad wasn't around. He was in the military, so he was in the Marines. Even before, like in college, he was in the Marines. I think I was maybe three when you kind of, it kind of hits you that your dad's like not there and you don't really know why. But then all of a sudden he is there again. How he explained it to me and how I got it best was he had to go take care of other people so that we could be safe where we were. I like understand and know that like he wants to be here, but he just can't. It's probably harder on your family because they stay at home and have to wait. You know, when, when you're gone doing your job, you're very busy, you don't have time to really communicate, you know, with your family while you're gone. He's not there for like birthdays and like family dinners. So you just don't really realize that until you're sitting at a dinner table and you're like, well, this sucks. I wish dad was here. After finishing my deployment in Iraq, I returned home. I remember seeing like his bus pull up. So when he came back, there was like this huge like charter bus of all the guys. And then I remember seeing like floods of guys like come off of the bus. You're relieved to be home. It's nice. To, it's great to see your family, you know, and you look at your kids again. My, they've, they've changed so much. And it, really the fun part is to see the excitement on their faces, you know, on your, your son and your daughter's faces and to get to hold them again. That's, that's the fun part of it. You don't really realize, like, he could have not come back. Like, we're so lucky that he did because some people, they don't get their dads back. So I'm very fortunate to have mine still here. That was kind of it for me. I kind of just knew when I was leaving that this is where I wanted to be. I thought it was a beautiful campus when we visited. You know, obviously we liked the coach and the campus was nice and educationally it fit what she wanted to do. It was very easy to talk to her dad. He's gonna kind of tell you what he thinks, whether you like it or not. I kind of deduced that if he's like that, she's like that. Seeing her attitude and the way she carried herself and then when I remember talking to her dad and seeing kind of the way he said things, I, I could see the similarities between the two of them. They have to understand, you know, that you have to be intense, you know, initially, that, that the training's hard, that the competition's hard, that, you know, you're going to suffer losses and you have to continue to play, and there's, there's pressure associated with that. Winning a MAC championship as a freshman was probably one of the coolest things I've ever experienced. I remember winning my match and then standing on the sidelines and, like, being so excited I couldn't stand still. I'm obviously very proud of her. Um, She's worked hard, you know, to to get work, to do what she's been able to do, and it can, you know, it's going to continue to take a lot of hard work uh, to be successful. And I think it's, you know, it's taught her a lot of valuable things about life. Whenever he can, he's always there, and I like him there now. Actually, I'd rather him be there than not be there. Having my dad here, getting to watch me like make history, it kind of makes up for everything that he missed. It's nice for him to finally get to like see what he worked so hard for and what he sacrificed kind of come back and almost not really reward him, but like put a smile on his face.